The following video will illustrate how to successfully navigate the 20 HIM A6. While mostly commonly used on PowerFlex 753 and 755 drives, it can also be used with the PowerFlex 70 and 700, as well as the SMC Flex and SMC 50. However, this demonstration will be for 750 series drives only. This HIM, which stands for Human Interface Module, can be installed on either the front of the drive, DPI port 1, or on the front of a cabinet or cabinet door using the DPI port located on the bottom of the main control board. If one device is plugged in here, it is port 2. Port 3 becomes available when using a DPI splitter cable plugged into the DPI port or if there is a 20-HIM-B1 bezel kit plugged into there, the HIM in the cradle becomes port 3 and the port on the bottom of the bezel becomes port 2, usually used for plugging a computer into the drive using a 1203 USB for programming the drive. For reference, the PowerFlex 753 and 755 can have a total of six option cards installed through ports 4 through 9. On high horsepower PowerFlex 755s, frame 8 and above, you will see ports 10, inverter, and 11, converter. Additionally, port 13 is the embedded Ethernet port in the PowerFlex 755 and the device logics is in port 14 in both drives. With the HIM installed, we will apply line voltage to the drive. Note that for simplicity's sake, we'll illustrate using the HIM in port 1, but operation of the HIM is practically identical if using port 2 or 3 or what is commonly referred to as the remote HIM. With the HIM and drive powered up, we see the main menu of port 0, which is the main control board. It will show the type of drive, the current and voltage rating, as well as parts of the drive catalog number. Additionally, it will show the current state of the drive, in this case, stopped as well as the output frequency. The buttons on the HIM include Start, Stop, Control Bar, and Folder. There are the 10 keys for numeric entry as well as Up, Down, Left, and Right navigation. Finally, there are five soft keys used in conjunction with the HIM display. There are two ways to select the various ports of the drive. The 4 and 6 keys can be used to move to the left and right to get to the other occupied ports of the drive. Additionally, the folder key can be pressed and the desired port can be directly selected. The folder key can be used to view many different features and settings within the drive. It has tabs or menus for parameters, diagnostics such as fault and alarm cues, memory where a HIM copycat can be performed which allows the user to save parameters in the drive to the memory storage on the HIM itself which is only used for backup storage or moving the HIM from drive to drive to put the same parameter values into other drives. Properties such as password setup and display line editing, and startup, where a user can follow a simplified parameter setup routine. Soft keys are the five buttons directly below the display on the HIM. Each physical key corresponds to the display selection directly above it. In order to navigate to a specific parameter number in the selected port, in this case, port 0, hit the PAR pound sign or hashtag soft key. A window will appear that prompts you to enter the parameter you wish to view. 
Type in the desired parameter number using the numbers on the keypad and hit the Enter Soft key. The parameter number, parameter name, and the current parameter value will then appear. From here, you can edit the parameter, if editable, navigate to a different parameter, or escape to the main menu, all by using the soft keys displayed at the bottom of the display. Controlling the drive in manual mode from the HIM can be accomplished by hitting the control bar button. A 3x3 grid appears on the screen corresponding to the keys on the HIM. From there, the drive can be issued a speed reference if the drive is configured to use port 1 for the speed reference. The drive can be put into manual mode, allowing exclusive control of the drive from the HIM. Finally, the Remove HIM option allows the removal of the HIM from the drive without faulting it.